guys, it's your coach Elaine Hardy Fit. I wanted to give you guys a little motivational pep talk about how to continue seeing the very, very best results that you can see using these awesome little containers. Um, I, I look at all of your posts and I see what you're all eating and you know, I always think of ways that I can improve what I'm doing and, and ways that I can help you guys tweak. So here's some of my observations and I'm not singling anyone out. Um, first of all, I have to, you have to make sure that you're tracking. I have to make sure that I'm tracking. How am I supposed to know if I'm eating the right number of containers every day? So yes, if I do a meal plan and I follow it, then I don't maybe need to track on my phone because I know if I eat everything on the meal plan, everything's going to fit. Remember that you all whoops, have a certain number of container allotments that you're supposed to be eating a day based on how much you weigh. So if you're consistently having, oh, I'm going to have an extra blue, I think, you know, I'll have extra almonds today, or I already had cheese today, but I'm going to have cheese again, or, oh, you know, I'm going to have some extra tortilla chips, you're not going to see great results. So you can't keep going over on your containers just because you feel like it. So that's one thing. you got to track, you got to plan it out, and you cannot go over. The second thing is the food list, okay? I want you to go back over the food lists and review them. Go through the book or you can use this sheet that I think I posted in our group. Remember that the foods on the top one third of the list are the healthiest foods. So if you're consistently eating foods like sweet potatoes and brown rice and avocados and kale, rock on, excellent. However, if you're consistently eating foods from the bottom of the list, like tortilla chips, English muffins, waffles, turkey bacon, salsa, pork, cheese, yeah, not going to see the best results. Now, those are on the plan, so I'm, not, I'm being very picky now. Those foods are on the plan, but if you're consistently eating those foods, which are not quite as healthy, maybe they do have more fat or they're more carby, you're probably not going to see top-notch results. So try to shift that. Try to eat less turkey, bacon, and waffles, and try to eat more ground turkey and sweet potatoes. Take the time to prep that stuff out. I know that Tortilla chips and waffles are quicker and easier, but they're not as healthy for you. You're not just doing this for, um, you know, weight loss per se. You're doing this for overall health. So if, if I want to help you be uber healthy, then I'm going to encourage you to have sweet potatoes and not tortilla chips. So those are things to keep in mind. So reviewing. Track, do not go over, and do not cheat. Cheating is not going to help you. If it's not on the list, you shouldn't be eating it. The second thing is eat off the top one-third of the list, and then you're going to get the best results possible. All right? Thanks, guys. Have a great day.